I'm so cooked right now. Hey, what's up, guys? It's Slimbo here. Welcome back to the channel, man. Thank you guys for joining me once again. Today, we're going to be talking about the World Series of Warzone cheating scandals. There are literally so many people that are participating in World Series of Warzone that are cheating on stream. People are getting clips. People are pulling clips. People are accusing others. It's getting crazy. We got to talk about the current and present problems here with the World Series of Warzone with the cheaters in them and how this is affecting the tournament why it matters so much why these people are cheating in a tournament and we're gonna go over the clips and give my thoughts on it so just based off like just searching up world series of warzone cheater there's people debating on like what call of duty could do better to actually make the tournament cheater free right people are saying there should be a land only for the prize pool about because the prize pool is absolutely insane remember everyone is fighting to get first second or third and or any amount. Any amount here is a good amount to make play Call of Duty. There's over a million dollars in prizes that you could win. And the first, I believe the first team gets $300,000. Do you know how insane that is to get $100,000 just from playing Call of Duty for a couple of weeks or and or days? But it's just so hard to get. And the fact that the tournament and the amount of money that's on the line and how high the stakes are for most players and most people it be ruined by cheaters just ruining the entire experience how fair it is and all that stuff i'm not gonna lie since i've come from fortnite and i've participated in fortnite tournaments before and where i've gone against cheaters and all that stuff as soon as the tournament ended and or during the tournament those players that were cheating that were openly cheating on stream in the game that were getting mass reported, called out on Twitter. Epic Games would actually ban them within minutes or hours. But this one guy, I don't know who he is. This guy right here has been cheating for days. It's basically sets the tournament at start. Because look at this. This is the first clip I've seen of him. So he has a recon drone. He sees those people. Right? Watch this. Do you guys see what's wrong with that? I'll play it one more time for you guys, okay? So he spots the five people here. Let's just see right here. Are you fucking dumb? How do you know there's a second guy when he's not even popped up? Remember, he said it right about here. He started saying here, watch. The second guy pops up after he says it, after he finishes his sentence. If I was cheating, bro, I would, dude, I wouldn't even stream, dude. I wouldn't even stream. Pull a clip for me in-game, okay? I don't understand how you are live streaming this, and you make a call out like that and actually expect no one to be sus about it, dude, and or find out about it. Anything that you post online or anything that you do online is there for life. There's a digital footprint. So him having, like, zero viewers or X amount of viewers, he's like, oh, no one's gonna see that I'm cheating. That's probably what he's thinking. What a fucking idiot. And it doesn't end there, though. We have a second clip. With the same guy. The same guy's cheating again. And remember, we don't know how long he's had these cheats. So he's been probably doing this since the start of the tournament and or before trying to act like he's good at all that stuff, which is absolutely insane, dude. Here, I'm here. Look at this. They're rushing a team, right? And he starts shooting at someone. Watch this. Watch this. He starts shooting at someone who's legit AFK. And you're like, you might be thinking, he's technically moving. If you spin, you make no noise in Call of Duty. You have to be walking and actually physically like moving your left stick. If you just move your right stick around, you know, just do whatever the fuck you want with it. You could spin forever and not be heard. So how the hell does he know someone's there? I just don't understand like how this guy thinks he's smart. Is anybody in there? Yeah. That's just the most sus shit ever. Why would you go back in there, right? The guy has made no audio cues. You have no knowledge where he is. So how else would you know that he's actually in there? And you shot directly at him and aimed right at him. Like, come on, bro. I don't know how Call of Duty has not banned this guy yet. I really don't. Because, because he needs to be disqualified, IP banned, hardware banned, banned for life, bro. From ever playing any Call of Duty. It's just absolutely insane to me. How Activision, whoever's doing the banned software and all that stuff, how Ricochet's not working. I don't know how this guy, I don't know how this guy is still playing the game. Look at this. Another team of cheaters in EU World Series of Warzone. This guy had a perfect, like, statement. Seeing cheaters compete in World Series of Warzone does not 
surprise me at all. Ricochet has been an absolute lie since, I don't think a lie, right? It, it works sometimes, but it's just not good at working. Four years ago, brand new anti-cheat, so no more cheaters. And here we are spectating a $1 million tournament where players are clearly cheating this game. <laughs> That's so funny. And I just don't understand how this is like happening at all. How do we allow this? How are they allowing this, bro? There's legit a $1 million prize pool. Money that can change lives. Money that can help the players out there competing and grinding to, you know, get a spot on the global finals and all that stuff and actually place well in the global finals. But the entire experience, the tournament, everyone's time is being wasted because cheaters are ruining it. If I was playing in the World Series of Warzone, if any streamer is, I would just stop playing. Not stop playing in the sense of just stop playing, but to just boycott this shit. You are all eyes on Call of Duty and Warzone that you guys are having a huge $1 million prize pool. You guys are going to ban players. You guys are going to fix your anti-cheat. You guys got to do any of that. I'm, I'm boycotting the game. I might have bought it already, right? You guys want all the eyes on Warzone right now with this $1 million prize pool. I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. If I was a good enough player to play in the World Series of Warzone and play these tournaments, bro, and I'm playing against a cheater, dude, and he's not banned and or disqualified at all after the several clips of him cheating... I'm losing my shit. I'm pulling up to Activision headquarters, going to Von Ahar's old office, and complaining my dick off, bro. I don't even know what the fuck that means, but you know what I mean, bro. It's just ridiculous how players have to deal with this, man. In a $1 million tournament, the biggest tournament Call of Duty holds themselves and hosts. It's just insane to me. Listen, Call of Duty doesn't do tournaments like Fortnite does. I don't know how. They make so much money. But the fact that you guys save up all this money for one huge tournament and it's infested with cheaters and hackers and all that stuff is absolutely embarrassing. You guys should be ashamed for not having a working anti-cheat, for not being quicker to disqualify and ban people. You guys should be embarrassed that you guys have to have people online on other social media platforms telling you guys that this guy's a cheater. The report system is shit. The anti-cheat is shit. Activision, dog shit. I'm actually annoyed by this because, dude, I'm so pressed about this because this should not be happening at all. This is a franchise, bro. This is a multi-billion franchise that has hundreds, thousands, millions of players Every time it drops a new game, people that stick with it, all that stuff. And the one time they're going to run a huge ass tournament for your biggest game mode right now, Warzone. And you can't detect cheaters. You can't ban and disqualify people immediately after the several clips of them cheating. It's just insane to me, man. I had to go with that little rant, man. I might be cooked out here with my fucked up room, my fucked up hair. Everything's fucked up. I woke up with a bloody nose. I don't give a fuck, dude. I'll play one Warzone game and hopefully like it just goes well. I've not played in, I'd probably say five, six days. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm kind of, I'm like cooked in real life and in game, bro. The entire cheating pandemic and like, I think this guy's cheat. Am I playing with an unlock tool guy? Wait, this guy is iridescent. There's no way. There's no way this iridescent John Gallus guy is actually good. I, I just actually just don't believe it. Dude, teammate, teammate. What are you doing? He's baiting me. Like this guy is trap. Why do you have... That skid and you're you're just trash. Oh my god, I'm dead. Dude, where are my teammates? Dude, this guy's just baited me. Oh my god, my teammates are fucking trash.